Calla, good morning to you. The gunman reportedly rolling up to Frank Calley's home here on Hilltop Terrace. You can see the brick building right here behind us still cordoned off in this crime scene as investigators continue going every over every piece of evidence at this hour. They're looking for anything that could lead them to this mob boss's hitman and whomever might be behind it. Six shots killed Francesco Cali outside his Hilltop Terrace home in a gangland-style mob hit Wednesday night. Police sources say he was the reputed boss of the Gambino crime family, whose power has been severely crippled by law enforcement in recent years. Around 9.15, gunfire rang out in front of the 53-year-old's brick colonial-styled home as he was ambushed by a suspect in a blue pickup truck and was then reportedly run over. Callie's murder marks the first time in 34 years that a crime family boss was gunned down in New York. It was three males wearing trench coats. In 1985, Paul Castellano, the former boss of the Gambino family, was fatally shot outside a Midtown Steakhouse, ordered by John Gotti, who succeeded him. Gotti then rose to power as the Teflon Don before ultimately dying in prison in 2002. Last year, Salvatore Zatola of the Bonanno family cheated death after being shot outside his Bronx home. His father was murdered in October. And come take a look at live Air 11 pictures right now. You can see that silver Escalade parked right out front of Callie's home. That's where he was believed to have been when those gunshots rang out again, six of them by a gunman riding in a blue pickup truck who also reportedly ran down that victim. He was rushed to an area hospital here on Staten Island, and that is where the 53-year-old was pronounced dead. At last check with police this morning, still no word on any suspects. They have not recovered the murder weapon. And no arrests have been made. Reporting live in Toad Hill, I'm Anthony DiLorenzo, Pix 11 News.